As the race for a coronavirus vaccine continues tonight, companies are racing to sell products that claim to kill dangerous pathogens in the air or on surfaces using UV light. CBS 2's Jasmine Veal investigates if ultraviolet light can actually work. On a hot August day, Godel technician Brian Jimenez climbs into an attic in a Simi Valley home to install a UV light in the air conditioning unit. So here we're getting ready for the UV light installation. He says this tiny ultraviolet light will reduce the amount of bacteria or viruses circulating in the air. Once the pandemic occurred, we saw a huge rise in filtration, UV lights, any products that pretty much are used to reduce the amount of allergens and viruses. During this COVID-19 pandemic, many companies are touting products that claim to prevent the spread of infection, like UV lights, from lamps to wands. USC engineer Andrea Armani and her lab team actually created a ultraviolet radiation system of their own to give to the Keck School of Medicine at the height of this pandemic. In my research lab, we developed uh, like a plastic bin that just has a UV source mounted on the side um, and it can hold, uh, it's a you know, 18 gallon bin, plastic bin, like you can buy at Lowe's. She created 55 of these disinfectant bins to help sanitize PPE and other medical equipment. She says this photo of a Petri dish shows how the UV light kills the exposed bacteria as seen on the right. So I think this is a really good way to tackle coronavirus. Armani says places like hospitals have already been using this particular spectrum of light called UVC to kill off contaminants. But she warns people can easily be duped into buying a product that doesn't work. So I went to see what I could find. So here I found some disinfectant UV lights at Home Depot for about $20. All of these wavelengths you can't see with your eye. So you have no way of telling if your light bulb is actually the right wavelength. Uh, so there, there is, it was recently on a YouTube video, uh, it's called the banana test. You hold your UVC light directly over the skin of a banana for a couple of seconds, and if it turns brown, then it works. As for this one, it doesn't appear to have done anything. Still, Armani says there are products out there that do work. So we really need to think about UVC as being kind of within our, you know, suite, our toolbox of ways to kill coronaviruses. I'm sure everything's good. Back inside this Simi Valley home, Jimenez finishes up in less than an hour. And for homeowner Eric Hoff, he says his peace of mind is worth any cost to install. The coronavirus made me kind of push me to getting it done. Um, just because I want everybody to be safe. Jasmine Veal, CBS 2 News.